We now know what started the overnight fire at Green Bay Preble High School last week. I can guarantee you it wasn't done on purpose. And the district is now changing its tune on the impact of the fire, now saying the new school year will not be starting on time. Even as crews say the work will be done around the clock. We'll be going 24 7 until the school's ready to open. New details tonight on the fire at Preble. Fire investigators now say spontaneous combustion ignited the fire in the school's gym last week. And they say district employees did not properly throw away rags, rags that had been used to clean up wood resurfacing products. Fox 11's Ben Krumholtz takes a closer look at just what happened. Fire investigators say this damage to Preble High School's gym might have been prevented if district employees had cleaned up correctly after resurfacing the gym's wood floor. They placed rags that were used to clean up some of the product that was used to resurface the floor, and that product actually spontaneously combusted with those cotton rags, started the plastic garbage can that was placed next to the bleachers on fire. Lieutenant Nick Craig says it was all caught on video surveillance. The school district says it's launching its own investigation to determine whether it should discipline its employees. So I can guarantee you it wasn't done on purpose. Usually the heat can be dissipated. UW-Green Bay chemistry professor Franklin Chen says the rag shouldn't have just been thrown away. He says wood resurfacing products have low ignition points, meaning enough heat will start a fire. But in the garbage can or whatever, what happened is that those heat cannot be dissipated. So those heat accumulate. You need to lay them flat so that that chemical can dry completely. When they're bunched up and balled up and put in a confined container, that's when that, that spontaneous combustion can happen. Lieutenant Craig says he's seen about 10 fires in his career that have started in a similar way. One of those was recently at a house in Alloway. About a month ago we had a similar fire in a garbage can with rags that were used in a wood process and then disposed of in a garbage can. So it's something that can happen. Restoration crews say they should know in the next day or two when students will be able to return. In Green Bay, Ben Crumholz, Fox 11 News.